tonight, we are excited to share with you a new segment we'll feature every Monday night in our newscasts. It's called Grant Me Hope, and that's exactly what the stories will aim to accomplish for Mississippi children living in foster care and hoping to be adopted into a loving home. Grant Me Hope is also the name of a nonprofit we're partnering with on this that is working tirelessly to help these children. I sat down through Zoom with the founder of this organization to find out more about her dream of helping these children in our backyard and throughout the country. Hi, my name is Israel. One thing I'm grateful for is being here and then waking up in the morning. Israel is 11 and loves sports. He wants to be a police officer one day, but what he wants even more is a loving family of his own. He is one of many boys and girls in foster care right here in Mississippi who long for a place to call home. There's a huge misconception that there's something wrong with these kids, that they're juvenile delinquents or something's wrong with the kids. These kids, there's nothing wrong with them. They are amazing children. Helen Zirup felt called to help. A foster parent herself with three biological kids, she and her husband Craig eventually adopted two children. And then one day, a foster care training video stopped her in her tracks. And I'm only half paying attention and this little guy comes on, he's maybe 15 and he said this and it changed my life. He said, my older siblings told me, once I reach a certain age, I'll be unadaptable. Then he paused and he looked real sad and he said, no one should steal your hope. And that hit me so wrong and I thought, oh boy, I better watch this better. Zirup and her husband own a trucking company in Michigan. So she got moving, calling her business contacts. And that's when she founded the nonprofit Grant Me Hope. I'm hopeful for a family that will take care of me and love me. The organization highlights older children and children in sibling groups who Zirup says are often harder to find homes for. A film crew meets them to capture their stories. There's a foster child statistic that haunts Helen Zirup. Once these kids reach the age of 18, they would age out. And once they aged out, 25% would end up homeless. So you might say this transportation company owner's driving force is to get the word out about these incredible kids. Grant Me Hope is featured on the back of each of her trucks and even on many of her competitors' trucks. You know, I always say to my team, if we get one child adopted, it was worth all the work, right? And I know we're getting way more than one child adopted. They're all really hoping I can get a good family that would treat me right. Hope. Every child deserves it. Let's hope we can help grant it. Look for our first child to be featured next Monday. If you would like more information about Grant Me Hope or the Children in Mississippi Foster Care available for adoption right now, just visit our website.